Hey guys, Britta here. Welcome back to the channel and welcome to a brand new game, House Flipper. Currently in the closed beta mode. Um, luckily I got access to the beta from the developers, Empyrene Games. I think that's how you say it, Empyrene. Um, they sent me through a code to access the closed beta, which is great news. So pretty much the idea of House Flipper is to buy a house, do it up and sell it, make money. So we'll go to new game. I haven't looked at the game yet, so what you're seeing is what I'm seeing. So there's a house here straight ahead. Graphics are pretty cool. So got use tool, change tool, um, tablet is tab to buy stuff. So let's go in. Oh, what a mess. So we need to clean up all this stuff. Don't know whose house this is. Kind of looks like my house a little bit. So check my mails. Oh, geez, the bed's a mess. It looks like my bed. Bathroom's clean. It's good to see. Um, here's our laptop. Buy a house to play. Okay, let's go mail. Inbox from Robert Moon. Hi, I brought a house. I bought house to refresh. I'd like to move into ASAP. So please make rooms clean and tidy. Except. Okay, so that'll be our first mission. So you will understand that the writing here does make um, things look a little bit weird. Like it's the developers aren't, um, their first language isn't English. So obviously things are probably um, not going to look as good as they would if it was developed by somebody whose first language was English. Obviously, just for for the writing reasons, but um, so our first job is just to clean up this guy's new house, which is an absolute pigsty. If you guys in Australia probably would understand this, but it kind of looks like a department of housing house. Ooh, basement. This guy's lucky to have a basement. Pretty cool. To actually, have a basement for gaming. It'd be cool gaming office, I reckon, down here. Um, shelving all looks good. So now we need to grab our cleaning tool. So we'll clean the floor. Clean the washing machine. There's this mess absolutely everywhere. Um, anything else in here that needs to be cleaned? Yep, there's another stain on the floor there. That tells you the room on the right hand side is 24 square meters. Clean dirt, 43%. So I'm not sure if that's just, um, yeah, just this room or not. Let's shut the front door so we can have a look around. Place is a, an absolute pigsty. I'm not sure if it's like a, it was like a party house or what, but it's pretty filthy. I'm not sure if that was spew all over the cupboard there or not, but so you can see this is part of our job. This is how we're going to make money. Going around cleaning things. Clean the lounge. So it's the spew or dirt, blood. Oh, I don't know. I don't want to know what it is, to be honest. It's more mess on the ground. This cupboard's absolutely filthy as well. So they might have either taken the TV with them or stolen it. One of the two. Uh, the window seals. Can we jump? We can. Good. Clean the window sill. That window sill's clean. That one's clean as well. Where else is there's dirt all over here? These guys are absolutely filthy. Uh, we'll go back to the hand tool. Dispose of all this. To to paint. We don't want to paint yet, do we? Dispose. Can we clean this up? I don't think so. Place is absolutely filthy, disgusting. New cleaning perk available. Click below hotkey to upgrade. Um, see some dirt on minimap. Faster cleaning, long range. Not sure what that means. We upgrade that. See some dirt on the minimap. That's pretty cool. 
So now we can actually see if we've missed anything. Not sure um, what the red thing is there. This could be broken. Undo that. Take it off. Um, let's put a new one on. That's what we're doing. Okay, cool. Beautiful. From now, you can complete you can complete. You're not fully completed by clicking return. Okay, we don't want to complete it yet because we're not finished. Um, still dirt on the ground here. And there. Bedroom's 92%. But not far off. Looks like bedroom's 100% clean now. So we can shut that door. Shut the basement. Still dirt everywhere. Shocking. Right, let's head into this little room. We don't want to complete the job when it's not 100%. Want to be well known, a well known cleaner around town. So you can maybe get some houses a bit cheaper or something like that. There's not a lot of sound going on for cleaning wise, which is a bit unfortunate. Be good if they implemented like a or something like that, like a bit of a, a cleaning noise, a scrubbing noise. Well, there's another spot here somewhere. Can we get it? There we go. Beautiful. So this, it's a saloon. That room is. That's what they're calling it. So it looks like. Might be some dirt. Oh, here somewhere. There we go. Some more dirt around here. Possibly. Ah, I see dirty walls. There we go. So the room's 74%. It's pretty good to know that once it's fully finished, we're going to get, it'll come up at 100% or it'll just disappear to say that it's clean, which is good. Um, there's another mark here on the floor. There we go. Room's done. Go upstairs. We're 96% complete now. Looks like there might be, ah, there we go. that done. Uh, bathroom, look at this, it's filthy, disgusting. Obviously this probably isn't the um, the main part of the game, but you've got to start somewhere to make money. You're not going to start a game with a ton of money, so shut that door, put it clean clean everything there we go 100 percent you have done 100 percent order you may complete order for 642 dollars you sure you want to complete yes thank you seven minutes and 31 seconds we'll get a ranking for some reason um let's not worry about the ranking it's taking too long okay so we're back home again Oops. Shut our front door. Go back to our computer. Buy a house to play. So here's the houses. First house to buy is 5200 Obviously we don't have that sort of money, but there's some very expensive houses here. 26000 which is okay, but 229000 353000 Wow. This will be the one that we go to, 5200 once we've got the money, of course. 
Um, let's go back to mail. Small house to refresh. Hi, I need your help. I brought a small house. I need to have three radiators mounted. Bathroom looks good but it has an old dirty toilet. Please mount a new one. I'd like to move in ASAP. So please make my rooms clean and tidy. Radio Sarah, we'll um, see what we can do. Nice little house. Wow, trash for days, again. Let's have a look, anything else? Oh, there's heaps of trash in here. That's an interesting door that goes into a bedroom, but anyway. You can see she needs radiators over there. We can dispose of this toilet. Um, anything else? That's out the back, isn't it? Yeah, it doesn't matter. So we need radiators. Um, let's go shop. Uh, radiator. Buy now. Put it in there. So we need to attach the tap. Screw it on there, attach the tap, turn it on and screw them on as well. So that's one radiator done. Where's the other three? She said she needed three. So there's another one in here. Buy now. Yep. Same again. So attach everything. Screw it all up, make sure it's all good. Buy and mount a new toilet, uh, bathroom, actually she wants a sink too, so where is that going to go here? Okay, let's see what the sink is. It's not enough space to place this item here. Okay, well let's go. Mountable toilet, place that there, we need to bolt it to the ground, so it doesn't go anywhere. Ooh, got to put everything on. That's pretty cool. There we go. Um, buy sink. Buy mountain new sink. Okay. Hmm. Maybe we've got to undo these first. There we go. Let's see now. If we go to mountable sink. It's interesting. There we go. Bolted in from the back with a washer and nut on. Washer, nut. Connect the pipes. Connect the tap. Well, it's pretty interesting actually. Actually, actually have actually have to put everything together, which is pretty cool. So let's um start cleaning the place up. So there we go. Any more dirt in here? There should be window sill. We're missing dirt somewhere. Hmm. Not quite sure where. It's saying it's only eighty six percent bathroom. There's lights that look like they could be cleaned. Anything on the roof? Nothing in the corners. Well, corners of the windows. Oh, there you go. Window itself. Done. That's a bathroom done. So let's go. Oops. Open the door again. Clean the window. Uh, where else? This window as well. 75%, 88%. There we go, done. Room's complete, so we can shut the door. It looks actually does actually look pretty dirty, but clean up the floor here as well. Oh, even the fridge is covered in junk, gunk and stuff. Oh, someone's a terrible cook. That's how I cook. Oh, that's interesting. You open the doors and everything. Josh, even that's filthy. 
Up there is all dirty. Dirty spot on the floor here. 83% clean. 91%. 94%. Where are we missing? Anywhere else in the fridge? Hmm. Oh, window. There we go. Always check the windows. We'll press L again. Actually go to perk so we can see most dirt in minimap, faster cleaning, um, long range. We'll go we'll upgrade the dirt in the minimap again, I think. And we've finished that job as well. Another six hundred and thirty eight dollars. Not gonna worry about rankings. Back home again. Good if we could sell all this junk. <laughs> Check out our laptop again. Another email here from Amanda Johnson. Hello, I dream about amaranth walls in my living room. I think that it's trendy colour, but I know that it is very strong and it shouldn't be on walls on room. Please paint selected parts of walls. The rest of all should be white. Thanks. So English is <laughs> a little bit bad there, but it's not too bad. Let's go on, go in. Okay, so paint room 24 square meters with amaranth and gray. Okay, so where's paint? Um, what color is amaranth? We need gray, so we can buy that. Um, Move that out of the way. Where's Amaranth? There. Wow, that is a shocking colour. Um, paint tool. Um, ugh. paint using Amaranth and grey. What wall do you want? This colour, that's the question. Hmm, interesting. That's a very trendy colour. Four, okay, six of 102. That's what it's saying. Some more paint on our brush. Get that bit done. So I wonder. I've been watching a few other guys play. Um, wonder if you paint it once and paint it again, does it go darker again? No, it doesn't. Okay, I thought it might have been like a made it a little bit darker. Let's move over here and. Get these little bits done. Might just make one wall pink and the rest grey, I think. Interesting to see what it actually looks like. Some more paint. We're going to be out of this paint soon. It's not a very attractive colour. I'm glad it's a girl's house, not mine. Just a little bit there. Little bits up the top here. So I really like the way how the paint actually works. Go back over here now and touch up these couple little spots. Oop, don't forget behind the radiator. Let's grab the grey paint. So make sure it goes up. It is, so that's good. Some more paint. I 
I'd much rather this colour than that pink. Pink is shocking. Make sure we don't miss any bits. Grab some more paint. Not sure if you can paint the roof either. Could have painted the roof pink. That would have been interesting. God, I hope she's happy with the colour, so I don't have to paint it over it all again. really like how it works, the paint actually, it's a pretty good idea. Good if you could get a little bit more wool done with the one dip, but that's just a small thing that I think it would be pretty cool to change, but obviously you wouldn't get to paint this much in real life with just one dip of your brush or your roller, so... It's good how the longer bits take longer to paint and the shorter bits don't take as long. These bits will be done a lot quicker than the full wall. New painting perk, cool. Let's have a look, uh, where are we? Perks. No, where's, we don't want a cleaning perk, where's our painting perks? Uh, where's painted? Mm, I'm not sure how to change our perks. Go back to perks, no, okay, oh well. We won't worry about it for now, I'll try and work it out later on I suppose. Should be that whole wall done. Top our brush. We're gonna do this side now. So we've got 85 of 102. Hopefully, once this, okay, there's no paint left in it. Dispose. Um, get some more paint. Where are we? Grey. Put wrong button. Get our roller back out again. We could have done um, grey stripe, pink stripe would have looked interesting. Definitely would have, wouldn't have been what I wanted in my house, but might have saved buying another tin of paint. We've got our feature wall there now, so hopefully she's happy with it. Too bad if she's not, because we're not doing it again. Done. We can't do the roof. Okay, so mount devices. What devices does she want? Uh, this one. Okay, let's go hand tool. Need to take this one off. She wants a new electrical outlet, of course. This one's just a little bit old, a little bit dodgy. It's a new one on. Cover on, screwed on. Here we go, there we go. Now there's in here, room to the right. She wants something. Okay, another really rusted electrical socket or outlet, whatever you want to call it. So you can't have a new house with beautiful fresh paint and outlets like that, can we? Done. There we go. Um, it's another one. Wow, three of them. Get this outlet off and replace it. So I'm not sure if that costs us money or not. You'd think it would. Um, having to replace these wouldn't be free. 
So order is 100% done. Oop, open that door back up again. We need to go to... Can we dispose of these? Um, I don't know. Throw it outside. Let's go back to perks. So how come we can't change to um, our painting perks? Uh, yeah, we'll complete that. Doesn't matter. When it comes up again next time, we'll press L and see what we can do. I don't know if there's any. Um, no, there's no like buttons or anything, so... Back into our emails. Anthony Gray, walls to knock down. Hi, I love open spaces, but in this home where I do not look are the door. I would like the living room to be an open space and do not have these awful doors. Not only people lose themselves. You can also improve the bedroom. I think it's too tight. At least probably through these colours and badly arranged furniture. My house isn't big, but it has too many doors. I don't like cramped corridors. Please knock down walls between corridor and living room. Thank you. Okay, we get our big sledgehammer out and see what we can do. So he wants, wow, he wants all this done. Can we sell that door? Not sure. We can sell that door. Let's grab our sledgehammer. Oh, come on, smash that wall. Hmm. Come on, hit that wall. Build wall upper. No. Sledgehammer. Eh, doesn't look like he wants to hit it very hard. Or am I doing something wrong? I don't know, to be honest. Wouldn't think so. Uh, walls modified, 9 of 28. That's because it's not letting me modify any walls. So it's the wall from here in. Hmm, okay. Not sure what's going on. Not sure if this is a bug or... Um, electrical outlet. So they want things replaced. So let's just replace the things we can. If we can't knock down the walls, we're just going to have to do as much as we can, I suppose. Come on, get off. Replace this electrical outlet. We've done heaps of these now, so we know how to do it. Right, in here, we need a radiator. So go to shop, radiator, buy. Got enough space, okay. Well, I'm not sure where they expect me to put it, but there, now see if we can fit it on the wall. There we go. Yeah. I want the bedroom painted as well, which we'll come back and do that. That's done. That's a really weird wall too, actually. Shut that. Wants another radiator put in there. It looks like. Change electrical outlet as well and paint the room blue. Pick this up and move this um, out of the way somewhere for now. Fix this up. Get the outlet off. Get 
new outlet on. There we go. Now we can pick this up again. So we can put it back where it was. There we go. It's not exactly the same spot, but um, let's go paint. Light blue, that's what he wants. Quickly grab our paintbrush. Start over here, I guess. Definitely a little bit better than the dark blue. Much better if we could clear the room out before we go to paint. We can't reach it from there, that's why. Use his bed stand on. Probably not slap paint everywhere. Crouch down. Can we get some more paint? Come on. Don't have to buy a can of paint. We've already got one. Come on. Fill up. There we go. painting the wall so obviously we're gonna have to do a lot of these missions before we can get our own money to actually be able to buy our first bungalow or apartment or little house before we can start making some real money instead of just doing odd jobs all the time I'm not sure if we're gonna fully be able to complete this job because I don't think we're gonna be able to knock those walls out for some reason there was an update to the closed beta today, and I do know people, I've seen people on YouTube knock down walls, so it could be an issue with the new um, update this morning. Um, I'm not sure, to be honest, or it could be me doing it wrong. But surely having a sledgehammer in the hand and standing next to the wall and pressing the whack button should be more than enough. Nearly finished, over halfway painted. Got any paint left? No. Let's dispose of this. Let's go and buy some more light blue. Go back to our paintbrush. Get all along the top done. Get that finished, maybe we can get it done. Do these parts of the wall as well behind the radiator. Be good to be able to eventually be able to buy like a spray gun. That'll be even better. So we're stuck in that little corner there. Get rid of the dark blue and put our light blue paint on over the top. So we're pretty much a handyman to start with, I think, and then um, we move on to renovating our own joint. Which is good. Like It would be pretty silly if we started with like, you know, $20,000 and just started renovating their own place straight away. So I guess this is sort of like a, a tutorial just to show you how things work. Um, 78 of 80, what have we missed? That bit's done, that bit's not done yet. Or is it? No, oh, that's done. So 
it's telling me we've missed two spots. Right, it's not that spot. Not that spot either, so I'm not sure. Aha, I think it's probably got something to do with this thing being in the way. There we go. That's one spot. 79. Not sure where the other spot's going to be. So these are done. It's something that's not fully completed, I would think. Looks like all that's done. Yeah, not sure which spot we missed, to be honest. I'm not going to go search around for it forever. It all looks like it's done. That'll do. Let's go sell that. Sell that too. Just get out of the way. It's annoying. Um, back into here. We want another radiator in here. some reason we can't uh, let's go back this up move this out of the way now can we do it there we go must have been because the washing machine was in the way we go done now we can pick it back up put it back in so there's still a few more devices that they want um, fixed another radiator here. Okay, we can't. Whoops, we can't do that because we need to move the bench out of the way. It's pretty silly that it's even put there. To be honest, the bench being that big. Okay, pick that back up. See if we can get it back in the corner. That's as close as we're going to get it, I think. Um, another radiator over here. Can we get this one on? Good, we can. Ooh, can we click it? Just. Okay, and something over here as well. So let's move this. Might have to put it outside, I think. Can we stick it outside? There we go. Get it outside out of the way. There we go. Place this socket as well. The outlet. So it's 62% complete. Are we going to be enough after doing this to not have to knock down any walls? Yeah, we can complete the job, which is good. We'll leave that out the front. Um, let's grab the hammer again and see if we can... Um, it's not doing anything, so I'm not sure. The reason why? Can we sell this no oops so it was a bit of a bug let's just complete that hopefully that stops spinning around around circles nope it's not it's gonna be the end of our first episode anyway guys but for some reason he's not happy but right, guys while we do um, backwards donuts We'll call that the end of um, episode number one of the House Flipper Clothes Beta. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, smash that like button, leave a comment, and let me know if you want to see some more. Hopefully you guys do. It's a game that I've been waiting for for a very long time, something I'm pretty excited about. I know it's most people are probably like, oh, it's not that exciting, but I think it's pretty cool. A good concept. Hopefully it can be done right to make it much more exciting. 
and a lot more stuff that we can do eventually in the future. As I said, it's only closed beta, so there's still a lot more updates to come. But if you did like it and you want to see more, as I said, like, comment, don't forget to subscribe. Make sure you hit that little bell next to the subscribe button to receive a notification every time I upload. It's been Brito's Gaming. Thanks for watching. See you again soon. Don't get dizzy.